Good evening, I'm Tom Eschen. The Michigan State Spartans look great in last night's 42-17 Holiday Bowl win over Washington Strait. Gina Trotman gave us a great look at what it was like to be there from pregame to postgame all over social media. And something we could tell from that is this meant a lot to the Spartans. Here's Gina in San Diego. Good evening, I'm Gina Trotman reporting from San Diego. It was in this end zone that the Michigan State Spartans got their 10th win this season, and it proved to be a pretty big one. Mark D'Antonio's sixth 10 win season as head coach of the Michigan State Spartans and his 100th win overall. 100 wins in 11 years, you do the math, that's nine wins a year on average. It's called Plus. great coaching. It's called great players. You know, we've had great players and we continue to have them. And uh, I'm blessed to, uh, to, to, to be here as a, as a head football coach. I've always felt like that from day one, and I still feel like that now, even more so. He's the type of guy who, you know, this morning at breakfast we're talking, and he stands up and goes, this isn't my 100th win. It's a program win. You know, that's, you know, that's what he preached all day. So, you know, it's a program win. But, you know, he's the man in charge, and, uh, you know, I'm glad that I'm playing for a guy like him. Especially in a turnaround season like this one, the Spartans have sure learned to have faith in their guy in charge. Coming out of last season, um, you know, everybody doubted Coach, and we stuck with him. We knew, you know, one season like that isn't going to, you know, change what he does and, you know, the way that he treats this team. Uh, for us to be able to come out this year and, you know, get the program back to where we, we believe it should be is, you know, huge for this program moving forward, but even bigger for him. Coach D is, is, is uh, I can't even describe, it's just a, a wonderful coach, great coach. Um, he just loves his players and he does do anything out for his players and that's what I love about him. Oh, it's amazing. Uh, we know all the hard work he puts in for us to uh, come out here and put us in the best position. Uh, coach D, he means everything to us. That's all of our father away from home. A turnaround, of course. 10 wins, impressive. But what may be the most significant is that this team has youth and a lot of promise moving forward. We can kind of build off the momentum that uh, this game um, brings us and you know with a lot of young guys we still have a lot of uh, a lot of work to be done and a lot of potential to be reached. Not many teams will have this much you know coming back who have played with great experience. Are you excited for what's to come with this program? Yeah I am very excited you know I think we have a good football team coming back I think we have an outstanding recruiting class coming I think we're hungry I think we're we're a humble group that will work hard believe in each other belief is such a big part of it we have confidence in each other We'll play hard and we'll play tough. That promise, for instance, their star running back, LJ Scott, he announced he will not be going to the NFL. He will be returning to Michigan State. And Brian Lewerke, their star quarterback, he's only a sophomore. For much more from the Holiday Bowl, head to our websites. That's WSMH.com and NBC25News.com. Reporting from San Diego, I'm Gina Trotman. Thanks, Gina. Nice job.